Okay, so in this tutorial video, we'll be explaining step by step on how to make shows with our controller and with the GUI and how to edit specific steps for your customized shows. Okay, so the very first step you'd have to do is select whichever light you prefer. For us, we'll be demonstrating with light one and light two. So press on light one, light two to make them both active. And then afterwards, register this light one and two at the desired point, say for instance like this. And the next step would be pressing the show button, which is on the side part. We have nine chases right here. So we'll be putting it in to chase number one. Press the button down for like three seconds, see it blink and you'll see that the screen shows that a step has been added. The next step would be navigating light one to a preference point that you want. Let's put in some color, some other gobos, light two to another point, also with some colors and a different gobo. And if you want to put this on step two, press on the same button for three seconds, see a blink, and you'll see that it's added a step. We'll be doing this and adding five steps for a demonstration. Number two, light with a different color. Maybe we'll put in some zoom. And put that on step three. Step four. I'll have it with color changing mode, like such. For light two, I'll be placing it this way with probably a strobe. And finally, for step number five, let's do this with a blue color. and that in white for step number five. After that, registering all the steps that you need with the show, make sure you turn on all of the lights that you've registered for using the shows and press, for instance, show number one and you'll see that each step is displayed as it should. So the default, default uh, step transition time and standby time are set to three seconds. So what you want to do to edit the gap between transitions and the standby time, you can press on the uh, register show number for over six seconds. And you'll see that the controller logged in to the edit version of this shows. You can select steps by scrolling upward with the joystick and by scrolling sideways you can also see that you can insert delete a step delete all steps or recall a single step. So we'll be into editing times then. Select edit times press enter for about three seconds and you'll see that there is a standby time. And if you scroll sideways, there's a transition time. We'll be setting the standby time to one second and transition time to 0.5 seconds. After that, 
Press enter for three seconds. And savings, new set times. Press exit to go back to the controller default. Press chase number one. And you'll see that the transition time for stem number one has been changed to your desired place. Do the same for step number two, three, four, five, and you'll have a total show with the customized step uh, standby time and the transition time that you want. And when you have a laptop at hand with the GUI linked to the controller, it's way easier to do the editing for the steps for your customized show. So on the GUI, there's basically two ways you can get into editing. So the first would be right clicking on the show that you've designed. For us, it would be on show number one. So if I right click here, you can see that there's edit chase times at step now, override step, delete step, delete all steps, and insert step before a desired step. So if I press on, say for instance, edit chase times, you'll see that show number one has five steps right here and you can type in any standby or transition time that you want to have your shows do the things that you desire. After that, press save. And that's it for the quick edits. And another way that you can tap into the show editing mode is press edit on the top left. Go to show management. And you'll see that our design five step show is right here with all the settings that you've inserted with the right click save exactly the same. You can also uh, modify anything that you want. And after that, make sure to press save and test it out on the shows. So these are the very basic steps that you need to uh, understand and make up any show that you want with our products. So if you want to learn more, you can also visit our website or our social media channels on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok, and you'll see that there are more tutorials to help you out.